There's nothing quite like the taste of a homegrown tomato, bursting with flavor and ripened to perfection. But achieving that delicious result in pots starts with the right foundation, the soil. Unlike growing in the ground, container gardening presents unique challenges. Pots restrict root space, and the soil tends to dry out faster. That's why a well-crafted soil mix is vital for your potted tomatoes. It provides the essential nutrients, drainage, and aeration necessary for vigorous growth and a bountiful harvest. A good soil mix will mimic the ideal conditions found in nature, ensuring your tomato plants thrive, even within the confines of a pot. Neglecting the soil can lead to stunted growth, yellowing leaves, and a disappointing yield. On the other hand, a well-nourished tomato plant will reward you with an abundance of juicy, flavorful fruits throughout the season. So, let's delve into the secrets of creating the perfect soil mix for your potted tomatoes. Creating the ideal soil mix for your tomatoes is like assembling a winning team, with each component playing a crucial role in their success. Each ingredient you add to your soil mix has a specific function that contributes to the overall health and productivity of your tomato plants. The key is to achieve a balance of nutrients, drainage, and moisture retention. This balance ensures that your tomato plants have everything they need to grow strong and produce bountiful fruit. First, you'll need a high-quality potting mix as your base. This mix serves as the foundation for your soil, providing essential nutrients and a good structure for root development. Look for a peat-based or cocoa coir mix, which provides a good starting point for drainage and aeration. These materials help create a light and fluffy soil texture that allows roots to penetrate easily. Avoid using garden soil, as it tends to be too dense and can harbor pests or diseases. Dense soil can restrict root growth and lead to poor plant health. Next, enrich your mix with compost, the gardener's black gold. Compost is rich in organic matter and nutrients that are essential for plant growth. Compost adds vital nutrients and improves soil structure, creating an ideal environment for beneficial microbes. These microbes help break down organic matter and release nutrients that plants can absorb. You can use homemade compost or purchase it from a reputable supplier. Either way, make sure the compost is well decomposed and free of contaminants. To ensure proper drainage and prevent water logging, incorporate perlite or vermiculite. These materials are lightweight and help create air pockets in the soil. These lightweight materials create air pockets in the soil, allowing roots to breathe and preventing root rot. Proper aeration is crucial for healthy root development and overall plant health. Finally, add a moisture retainer like coconut coir or peat moss. These materials help the soil hold onto water without becoming soggy. These ingredients help the soil hold onto water without becoming soggy, ensuring a consistent moisture level for your thirsty tomato plants. Consistent moisture is key to preventing issues like blossom and rot and ensuring your tomatoes grow juicy and flavorful. Now that you have gathered your ingredients, it's time to put them together and create your perfect tomato soil mix. Don't worry, it's easier than you might think. Start with a large container or tarp, as this will make mixing easier and less messy. Add two parts of your chosen potting mix to the container. This will form the base of your soil blend. Next, add one part compost, one part perlite or vermiculite, and one part coconut coir or peat moss. Remember, you can adjust the ratio slightly based on your specific needs and preferences. For example, if you live in a particularly wet climate, you might want to use a bit more perlite for improved drainage. Once you have added all the ingredients, it's time to mix. Use your hands or a trowel to combine everything thoroughly. The goal is to achieve a light, fluffy texture that is not too compacted. You should be able to easily run your fingers through the mix. Creating a good basic soil mix is a great start but why not go the extra mile to ensure your tomatoes thrive? A few simple steps can make a significant difference in the health and productivity of your plants. First, check the pH level of your soil mix. Tomatoes prefer slightly acidic soil, with a pH between 6.0 and 6.8. You can purchase a simple pH testing kit from most garden centers. If necessary, amend your soil with lime to raise the pH or sulfur to lower it. Next, consider adding a slow-release organic fertilizer to your mix. This will provide a steady supply of nutrients throughout the growing season. Look for fertilizers specifically formulated for tomatoes, which will contain the right balance of nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. Remember to avoid using garden soil in your pots, as it can introduce pests, diseases, and compaction issues. 
Stick to your carefully crafted soil mix to provide the best possible environment for your tomato plants to flourish. Section 5. Planting for Success. Giving your tomatoes the best start. With your perfect soil mix ready, it's time to plant your tomato seedlings and set them up for success. This step is crucial for ensuring that your plants grow strong and healthy, producing an abundant harvest. Choose a pot that is at least 12 inches in diameter and has drainage holes to prevent water logging. The size of the pot is important because it gives the roots enough space to grow and access nutrients. Fill the pot with your soil mix, leaving about 2 inches of space below the rim. This space will make watering easier and prevent overflow. Gently remove your tomato seedling from its container, being careful not to damage the roots. Healthy roots are essential for the plant's uptake of water and nutrients. If the roots are circling at the bottom, gently loosen them with your fingers. This helps the roots spread out in the new soil, promoting better growth. Dig a hole in the center of the pot that is deep enough to bury two-thirds of the seedling stem. Burying part of the stem encourages the plant to develop additional roots along the buried section. This encourages the development of a strong root system which is vital for the plant's stability and nutrient uptake. Place the seedling in the hole and gently backfill with soil, firming it gently around the base of the plant. Make sure the plant is upright and stable. After planting, water your tomato seedling deeply, allowing the excess water to drain out of the bottom of the pot. Deep watering helps the roots grow deeper and stronger. This will help settle the soil and ensure good contact between the roots and the surrounding mix. Proper contact is essential for the plant to absorb water and nutrients efficiently. Section 6. Avoiding Common Pitfalls – Mistakes to Avoid for Healthy Tomatoes Even with the best soil mix, a few common mistakes can hinder your tomato plant's growth and productivity. These mistakes can be easily avoided with a bit of knowledge and attention to detail. By being aware of these potential pitfalls, you can avoid them and ensure a bountiful harvest. A little extra care can go a long way in making sure your tomato plants thrive. One common mistake is overwatering. This is a frequent issue for many gardeners, especially beginners. While tomatoes need consistent moisture, too much water can suffocate the roots and lead to root rot. It's crucial to find the right balance. Allow the soil to dry slightly between waterings, and check the moisture level by sticking your finger an inch into the soil. This simple test can save your plants from overwatering. If it feels dry, it's time to water. Consistent monitoring is key to maintaining the right moisture level. Another common mistake is using a pot that is too small. This can severely restrict the growth of your tomato plants. Tomatoes are vigorous growers and need plenty of space for their roots to spread out. A cramped pot can stunt their growth and reduce yield. Choose a pot that is at least 12 inches in diameter, or even larger for indeterminate varieties that continue growing throughout the season. The right pot size can make a significant difference. Finally, be sure to provide your tomato plants with adequate support. This is essential for their overall health and productivity. As they grow taller and heavier with fruit, they will need a sturdy stake, cage, or trellis to prevent them from toppling over. Proper support helps them grow upright and strong. This will also improve air circulation around the plants, reducing the risk of diseases. Good airflow is crucial for preventing fungal infections and other issues. Section 7. Reaping the Rewards – The Joys of Homegrown Tomatoes With the right soil mix and a little care, you'll be rewarded with a bountiful harvest of delicious homegrown tomatoes. Imagine biting into a juicy, sun-warm tomato, bursting with flavor, knowing that you nurtured it from a tiny seedling to a fruitful plant. The taste of a homegrown tomato is simply unmatched. It's sweeter, juicier, and more flavorful than anything you'll find in the supermarket. Plus, there's a sense of satisfaction and accomplishment that comes with growing your own food. But the rewards of growing tomatoes go beyond just the taste. Gardening is a wonderful way to connect with nature, relieve stress, and get some exercise. It's an activity that can be enjoyed by people of all ages and abilities, and it's a great way to teach children about where their food comes from. Section 8. Beyond the Basics, Additional Tips for Thriving Tomatoes While mastering the perfect soil mix is crucial, there are a few more tips to ensure your tomatoes flourish. These simple additions can significantly impact your harvest's quality and quantity. First, consider the size and material of your containers. While a 12-inch pot is a good starting point, 
Larger containers, particularly those made of porous materials like terracotta, can provide better insulation and moisture retention. Secondly, don't be afraid to experiment with different tomato varieties. From cherry tomatoes bursting with sweetness to heirloom varieties with unique flavors and colors, there's a tomato out there for every palate and growing condition. Lastly, remember that consistent care is vital. Regularly check your plants for pests or diseases and address any issues promptly. Provide adequate water and fertilizer, and enjoy the process of watching your tomato plants grow and flourish. Section 9. The final word, embrace the journey to bountiful harvests. Growing your own tomatoes in pots is a rewarding experience that brings the joy of gardening and the pleasure of fresh, flavorful food to your doorstep. And it all begins with the right soil. By understanding the essential components and mastering the art of creating the perfect soil mix, you provide your tomato plants with the foundation they need to thrive. Remember to choose the right container, provide adequate support, and offer consistent care. Don't be afraid to experiment, learn from your experiences, and most importantly, enjoy the journey. Embrace the opportunity to connect with nature, nurture your plants, and savor the unparalleled flavor of your very own homegrown tomatoes.